Food allergies are common in children, but if you're an adult without any allergies, you probably assume you're safe. That could be a deadly mistake. That's why a member of our Local 4 family is sharing her terrifying ordeal. It was June 9th, I'll never forget it. I was eating dinner. And it was Chinese food, a dish she'd had many times before. It was rice and shrimp and some sauce, and I took the bite, and then immediately the inner part of my lip started to itch. And I didn't think anything of it. Kyla goes to bed, but wakes up a couple hours later. I noticed that my lip was twice its size. Startled, okay, okay. I was like, oh my gosh, like I must be, I must have gotten bitten by something. She takes Benadryl and goes back to bed. Hours pass, and Kyla's lip continues to swell. A voice inside of me said, get up right now and go to urgent care. She feels lethargic and is having trouble breathing. At the urgent care, a nurse begins to examine her. And so she starts to feel my throat and she goes, oh my gosh, your throat's closing up. And, th and then that's when everything broke loose. And then she just starts pushing in medications. It happened all so fast that it scared me. I, I thought I was dying. The staff asks Kyla what she had to eat. I'm like, I didn't eat anything that was out of the ordinary. I just had this and this and this. And she goes, well, you might have an allergy. I'm like, I have no allergies. She goes, now you do. It would take several weeks and extensive allergy testing to find out what was truly to blame. I am allergic to peanuts, tree nuts, especially hazelnuts. And I have a mild allergy to coconuts and rye. It was a total shock. Remember at 42, Kyla had never experienced a food allergy before. I have eaten peanut butter my entire life and I've never had anything like that happen before until that day. Kyla's experience may sound unusual, it's not. Nearly half of adults with food allergies report at least one of those allergies developed in adulthood. Food allergies can occur at any age and the reactions could be severe at any age. Dr. Annie Ari Mensa from the Asthma Allergy and Immunology Institute says symptoms can seem mild at first. Runny nose, itchy mouth, itchy throat, some hives, itching on your skin, stomach discomfort. But progress to a severe reaction. Constriction in your chest, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, to full-blown systemic reaction that your blood pressure could drop, you could have cramps, you could actually... Um, go into full-blown anaphylaxis, which is shock. If you experience any of those initial red flags, it's critical to seek medical help fast. Kyla can't help but think what could have happened that fateful day. If you don't know you have it, um, an allergy, and you have a reaction like that, it's very easy to have something terrible happen to you, and that was the scary part. Kyla now carries an EpiPen at all times and must be careful to avoid the foods she's now allergic to. I think it's important for people to know that it can happen over 30, over 40, at any time in your life as an adult, it could be fatal. And that's the scary part about it. So the most common adult onset food allergies are shellfish, peanuts, and tree nuts. Take it from me, I found out firsthand that I was allergic to cashews specifically at 41 years old after I had given birth to my twin boys. So the takeaway here, if you suspect you're having any sort of reaction to a food, get help right away. Don't ignore it. Back to you.